got somebody, she's a beauty, very special, really and truly, take a care of me, like it's a duty, on my body, my side. We are on a big jet to Phuket right now. I think I only have 54 seconds. I might have to change out my SD card, but I just wanted to update you guys. We are in the Bangkok airport on our way to Phuket. But just to Phuket, I'm like, yeah. How you feeling? <laughs> Wonderful time, tired. So we're gonna get on the plane and make coffee. Oh yeah, definitely gonna get coffee. Definitely need coffee. To Hopefully by the time we get to the resort in Phuket, they're still doing breakfast because we got free breakfast. So hopefully we can oh, snack. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we can snack some breakfast. But I'm really excited. at our resort we're just waiting to check in but they told us we can come to the pool so we're at the pool sister hi she's living her best life reading but i just ordered some food i was starving take a look i'm gonna read in a little bit i'm still catching up on birthday messages so still doing that um this is what the pool looks like pretty nice day I'm about to grub so but I will come back to you guys once we get to the room and I'll do like a little room tour but right now we're just gonna relax mm, that's good <laughs> Welcome to my crib. We are in Phuket, big Phuket. You already know the vibes. We upgraded our suites. We upgraded our room. Um, we weren't feeling it and we were like, we want a room with a view. So I'm gonna show you guys our upgraded room. But here are the beds, just two twin beds. Super cute, very Thailandy. Come get closer, come get closer. These nice fans, mm -hmm. okay. Um, and then over here, we just have this nice place, a nice little closet system, some robes, a hair dryer, and a nice full slippers, slippers, and a nice full length mirror. Boom. And then here is the bathroom. Super freaking nice. Nice little deep tub. All the old bunny ears, towels. Um, nice um, amount of space here, honestly. Um, look at the shower, walk in the shower, very nice, very nice, and look at what they did to the top of the dog, so cute. Alright, and then let's go to the best part of it, it's like a little balcony here, it's like a little balcony, we can hang our things out to dry, and then, follow me, we have a nice little breakfast nook. We can sit down, take a look, bask in your life and your glory. Yeah. TV, chair, and then y'all ready for the best part? Come on. <laughs> this is our view. <laughs> Yo, I hate you. <laughs> this is sickening, like so so sickening i love it here like i really do and that completes my mtv cribs happy birthday to me at 24 and phuket i'm here with my sister we live in life love her life <laughs> i know she hate that <laughs> but yeah good take a look at this view life is good okay <laughs> vlog I'm back, so we got dressed and ready to go hit the town. 
we're gonna probably go to Karan Beach. That's the beach that's closest to us. And yeah, and hopefully we can ride scooters there. Right now we're about to go to the bar so I can get some ice and some water. Um, and maybe a little drinky drink, but let me show you guys. Ooh, the lighting is not picking up. I'm going to show you guys my outfit of today. It's just this romper from Pretty Little Thing. You guys even see this? Romper from Pretty Little Thing. It has like the little Pretty Little Thing logo on it. And then bathing suit also from Pretty Little Thing. Super cute. About to go right now. Got my little bag packed. I'm gonna grab my phone and my portable charger and then we'll, I'll take you guys with me. Real pineapple, I don't know. It's me and my sister here in the lobby. We are going to James Bond Island today. Um, really, really excited. They gave us some breakfast before we go because we're gonna miss like the regular breakfast here. Um, so that's exciting. I'll do a little fit check. So I'm just wearing this Avon Dutch hat that I customized to be pink to match my pink bottoms. Um, shorts Zara um, swimsuit underneath is eh, Shein top is just a regular regular wife beater I probably got from like Target or something that I just cut up but let's see what this breakfast is hitting for okay okay very cute very cute what's this milk What's in this paper bag? Maybe granola? I don't know. Banana, an egg. I'm guessing it's hard boiled. I don't know what this is. A lime? Doesn't look like a lime, but. And then some ketchup, some yogurt, um, and they gave us some water. Sister and I are just gonna wait for the guy to come pick us up, and then we're gonna head
morning to save my man. I don't know what this is all about, but I'm going up this mountain to save my man. vlog good morning day what is it day three in phuket? day three in phuket um yesterday we went to james bond island and they took us to a bunch of different like places around the island where we got food we did like underwater cave exploring what else do we do we relaxed at one of these beaches i really don't remember the name of the beach but um what was the what was the what else did we do james bond island we did canoeing um we didn't canoe thank god because if we was the ones rowing the boat we would have got stuck and lost but that was really fun it was very adventurous like way more adventurous than i intended on it being i guess um but today we're gonna take it easy we're just gonna chill we're gonna go to this beach club um and i'm thinking that we can go to big buddha today since we were not able to go the first day i think we should go see big buddha today so we'll probably do that just do some exploring just some local things um and then tomorrow we're going to go see the elephants and it'll be our last day in Phuket. But I just wanted to update you guys. It last, last night we also got dinner and we did take some photos, get some content. But right now we're going to go to breakfast. I did purchase a breakfast, like the breakfast package. But we've been waking up early every day and this is like the first day where we'll actually be able to get breakfast. So really excited for that honestly because... Ooh. But let's go eat. I'll take you guys with me, show you guys what the breakfast buffet is giving. And pastries. We have toast. We have butter. Fresh milk. Oh, these are just like thingies. But where's the food food? Oh, the food food over here. So, we have noodles. Pancakes, waffles. Rice. 
grilled pumpkin. For sausage, potatoes, tomatoes, baked beans, fish sauce. Breakfast with a view. Hi vlog, we are on our way to Big Buddha. Um, we are in our taxi now. Here's my sister. And we'll do a fit check when we get there, I guess. But I'm just wearing this green two-piece set from Shein. Um, I'll probably have to safety pin this because you have to be covered at the temples. So I am wearing like a long sleeve shirt and long pants. Not the best for the weather, but we move, you know. But yeah, I'll show you guys and talk to you guys a little bit more when we get there. But look at the view. Unreal. I just keep saying that because everything here is actually unreal. like unbelievable. <laughs> a lot of the things that I've been showing you guys are like very much like you have to be here kind of vibes. Like pictures and videos are doing it no justice. Like none. Well, it is still beautiful in pictures and videos, but like in person, crazy. Like Big Buddha, like just turning the corner and seeing Big Buddha was crazy. But right now we're on our way to Catch Beach Club. We take some photos in this cute bikini. It's from IMG um, and has like a matching jacket so I'm gonna try and take pictures and just enjoy and relax like this is the first time I've been on a vacation where I actually like relaxed on the beach and like didn't do a crazy excursion day you know I feel like every other vacation is just excursion excursion excursion, excursion, excursion. but this one I'm like okay I can relax for one day like enjoy take it all in you know I feel like a lot of the times I don't do that what do you think I'm definitely enjoying the relaxation on this trip. Mm -hmm. It's different. It's <laughs> ten times different. All the trips we've ever been on as a family or just you and me, mm -hmm. it's always, always go, 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 go. go. <laughs> and like, it's nice to just relax And sometimes. especially like take in the scenery mm -hmm. too. Like the view from my room is crazy. Yeah. Like, I can't get over how beautiful that view like, is Like I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> my view is literally just the backyard. But nevertheless, I really do enjoy like the relaxation part of this um i really like it would have been nice to go to pp island just to go there but i didn't want to do like snorkeling and all that stuff but it would have been nice to go but nevertheless we're going to go to another beach and it's still going to be beautiful because this whole place is beautiful um we still need to get souvenirs and um there's something else we need to get oh i still haven't had boba we can probably get that when we go back to bangkok but um yeah so we're on our way to the beach and I'll just show you guys the beach when we get there.
that's not to come back since I had to. So then just pose, because I'm still recording. Go back to America. You should add in the wah wah wah. <laughs> 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 Alright, let's go eat. Alright, Miss Naomi. Welcome to your QA. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, so today is the last day of the trip. How did you enjoy your trip? So I enjoyed it so much like I'm so sad to go home like this can't be the last day like this just can't be here scale of 1 to 10 how would you rate the trip? I would rate it a 10 because everything here has just been so amazing everybody has been so nice everything has been actually very affordable too like when you come here it's gonna be affordable the flight may hurt your pockets but when you get here it's affordable um but yeah i would say it's a 10 like out of my whole experience i'm only did 10. and then what was your favorite thing to do this whole trip my favorite thing from this whole trip was probably yesterday um when we went to big buddha and when we went to the beach i feel like it was just a very relaxing day um the coolest thing um, that we did was probably the underwater cave. I think that was like the coolest thing. I don't know. We haven't done the elephants yet So that might like top it, but 
I feel like that was so cool. Like something me and my sister have never done. Like when we told my, our mom, she was like, y'all were in the underwater cave. So I think that's, that's what I think. So what was a favorite thing from your birthday, from your two birthdays that you spent here? So my favorite um, thing about my birthday in general was just all the birthday love. Like, I'm a vibe for real. They understand that. <laughs> like, I'm really, my vibe too raw. I really feel like, I, like all the birthday love I received and like, you know, people sharing their memories um, with me and like, you know, sharing all their nice long birthday messages. I just thought it was so sweet and it really was a testament to like who I am as a person. Sometimes you just need a little, a little outside reminder of, you know, how people feel about you. And I think your birthday is like a, the best day for that to happen and the best day for you to get, you know, some clarity on, you know, where you're at in life, you know? Like, when I was getting all the, all the birthday love, I was getting people from all walks of all walks of my life, like every different stage of my life. And I just think that it's so cool. It just reminds you of like, you know, how far you've come and all the people that you've met along the way. And then it just gets you excited for more people that you're gonna meet. So I don't know. That's just how I feel about my birthday. Alright. Well thank you for coming to your QA. Okay. Welcome to your QA. How has your Thailand trip been on a scale from 1 to 10? It's been a 15. Oh, it has been so relaxing. Not broke so, the scale. So relaxing, so peaceful. Right now, it's the top vacation I've ever taken. Oh, wow. Until I take, you know, a better vacation. Mm -hmm. This is like top tier. Mm -hmm. Just because, like, this is stuff that I look forward to, like being able to relax on the beach like we did yesterday, watch the sunset, mm -hmm. listen, I don't know why, but like listening to birds chirping, seeing butterflies, mm -hmm. we went to part uh, Big Buddha yesterday, mm -hmm. like all that was just peaceful for me. And it was just like, it warmed my heart and I was just like, dang, I'm really in Phuket, I'm really in Thailand. Right, like right. everything really sat in for me. And I don't know, that was like, that's why it's like top tier 15 out of 10. Okay. So, what did you like most about Bangkok? It reminded me of like New York. It reminded of me, like reminded me of being in Philly, the downtown area. You have like a lot of hustle and bustle. But the difference with Bangkok is it's nice and smooth. Like you're not, you know, being hassled on the street like every five seconds, getting catcalled or anything. But like, that's what I like most about the, uh, Bangkok. That and the floating market. The floating market was nice and cute. Mm hmm. What did you like most about Phuket? I liked most about Phuket the big Buddha experience that we did. Like the underwater cave. Crazy. Don't think I would ever do that again because it's literally crazy. But <clears throat> Big Buddha, very nice and peaceful. If there's a theme here, it's peace. <laughs> and the theme for my 24th year, hello, focus on me, thank you. The theme for my 24th year is make love, not war. <laughs> so, <laughs> the peaceful vibes is really starting right now. <laughs> so, yeah, but we're going to finish eating and then go to the elephant sanctuary and take you guys with us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like a dog as well. Okay, so right now, 
Yeah. That is not enough. It's real paper. Oh, am I supposed to turn around the other way? <laughs> How much food does it take? <laughs> and use your hands, break it up, go around. This is thick food paper. So it goes from bread, to get some brown to brine. Are we uh, boil it? Okay. Yeah, boil it and soak with the water, dry it, and back to broil it again until you many protests if you get it. But that is not. Okay. 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 Uh, you want to sit there, you don't walk here. Oh, walk here? And here. And here. And here. Okay. Mm. Yeah, you sit next to elephant here. Yeah. Everyone, I recommend you know I like five minutes to that. Please leave that first, okay? And after that, I'm going to leave. Name Mommy. <laughs> so really gentle. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I just feed and feed in the other foods. Okay. <laughs> Is it yummy? <laughs> Thailand spaghetti. Okay, really famous in Thailand. If you come to Thailand and never ever try Pad Thai, if you back home, that means you never been to Thailand. Okay. <laughs> so the main ingredients. So we have this one, rice noodles. Okay, rice noodles. We not cook it. Normal water 15 minutes. Alright. Followed by a uh, slice of shallot, onions, okay. uh, pico radish, radish, pico Alright. And put oil in. Okay. Stir the pan. Stir the rice. 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 Stir the to go back to the States, back to America tomorrow, but we wanted to get here because our flight leaves out of Bangkok. So we got an airport hotel that's 10 minutes away from the airport, but it's super nice, so let me show y'all. So first, we got a nice little closet system, love this. Um, nothing too crazy here, I'm sure this is a hair dryer. Um, got some robes, I feel like the robes have been Every hotel has a robe. Like, I feel like in America, not every hotel got a robe. And here's the bathroom. Super quaint, but still very cute. You have this nice um, ceiling mirror. Nice dark vibe. Toilets. And then here's the shower. Very cute overhead. And just some towels, obviously. You know, normal, normal things. But moving on over here. We got a little fridge. Sorry, all of our bags are in here. We got a little fridge. I hope you're hungry <laughs> for nothing. It's not even cold, it's hot in there. Um, little station, normal, regular, like the hotel things. And then, oh, you guys can't really see it right now, but this is a little bench, <laughs> obviously, with all of our nonsense on it. And then just twin beds. It's a really cute, like earthy, Thailandy vibe. Um, and then here's the TV. 
There's a little vanity area, which is cute. You know. <laughs> um, and then we have a view of homes. Um, there's like a little like sky view over there. I'm sure we might be able to see like the sunrise or something. Um, if it doesn't rain, but oh look at look at that up there. I don't know what that is. It's a sky bar. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> So we're gonna get settled and then we're gonna get some food and then come back and just unwind. Like it's been a long trip, but it's been so great and we get to spend our last day in this super nice, cute little hotel and just soak in the last little bits of Thailand before we leave. But um, I think this will be the last time you guys hear from me. So be sure to like my video if you like my video. Be sure to comment down below what you thought of the vlog. This is so exciting. What you thought of Thailand. What you thought of my experiences, my outfits, anything. I'm here for it. Let me know. Comment down below. Um, and then let me know if you also have any questions about my trip. I literally booked this whole thing did the whole itinerary did all the research so let me know if you have any questions i'll be happy to answer them and be sure to follow me on my socials on my instagram my tiktok because that's where all the content is going to be all the photos all the funny tiktoks all the dances all that good stuff that's where it's going to be and then yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in my next one Bye. Nigga, that ain't good game, homie, sorry They say conversation, through the nation I can tell, but I could